Hey y'all, this is Jessica at Casa Magnolia and today I am doing the clean closet challenge. Once again, I wanna thank my new friend Heidi. Her channel is called Heidi Sonbull for hosting this challenge. This was just such a genius idea that she thought up and I am so excited to show you guys how I turned my entryway coat closet into a cleaning closet. Now I really didn't feel like I needed a coat closet because we have a little mudroom area with hooks and I just felt if we had a few guests over, you know, we can use that little mudroom area. If we have people staying for a long time, then, you know, they'll be in the guest room and can put their stuff in the guest room. So let's get started. You can see that this was just a shelf with a pole and that was all we had in here. So I will start with the door. I got this little shoe holder from Walmart. It just houses a couple of my like random or zone cleaning items. So stuff that I don't usually keep in my caddy, I just put in here, you know, cause I don't always use the disinfectant spray or the little linen spray and stuff like that. Now this is also where our router and stuff goes. So I would like to get a basket and weave the um, cords and stuff up there. But I couldn't get that figured out because as you can see, it's like a nest up there. So that's a project for another day. On the top, I have my cleaning caddy. And sorry, it's so dark, guys. I do have a pretty big cleaning caddy because I like to keep um, my toilet brush in there. So I like that to be long. Right next to it, I have some blue nitrile gloves. These two stackable bins, and I'll try and get back here. These two blue stackable bins are from Dollar Tree and in those I have labeled with some just dry erase marker that the bottom one I'm keeping my light bulbs in and the top one I'm keeping my extension cords in. And I do want to mention that I left a little bit of room up here so I'll try and scoot back so you can see it. I just left a little bit of room since our ceilings are so high to put our air filters. Now, like I said before, we just moved into this house so I haven't actually gone out and purchased air filters yet but I wanted to leave a space to have those. Now I kept my cleaning rags on the pole here. This is a Dollar Tree bin that I got, I don't know, I think a couple summers ago when they had pink stuff. And then I used shower curtain rings to hold it up there. And then on the other side, I have this shoe holder from, oh, I got this at TJ Maxx and I put my paper towels in it. You could also put toilet paper in it. As you can see, I desperately need to go to the grocery store to get more paper towels, but weather is not permitting that right now. So um, on the back, I also, let's see, let's back up. I have my shark steam cleaner back here. It's on a little footstool. And then I hung my just um, broom from a command hook. And then I wanted to show you guys this beautiful printable. Heidi made this free printable for us. It is a 2018 calendar with the pretty um, floral motif on it and I cannot wait to use this. I have it in here because I am going to start assigning my zone cleaning. So I would like to do another video on zone cleaning but I just wanted to show you guys this thing is gonna be so great for assigning which week is going to be which zone. This is the, um, well, I guess the eight and a half by 11 that she made, but she also made a 16 by 20. If you wanted to frame it and put it in an office to make it bigger, that would be so awesome. So thank you so much to her. Be sure and look down in the description box and I'll link Heidi's video so that you can go get the free printable from her. Now down on the floor, I have our really big step stool in here and it's nice to have it in here because I used to have to like go shimmy around the garage to get it when I needed it. So it's super nice to have in here. I've used that a lot. And then I have my mop and bucket. And since we have hardwood floors, I just put another little towel down there just in case. We have this big old dinosaur of a Kirby vacuum that I have had for probably a decade now. It works so good you guys, but God, it's heavy. And I don't love that we have so much stuff on the floor, but honestly, I really don't have any room anywhere else to put this besides taking it out to the garage. So this has worked out really nicely. 
In the corner, I also have the accessories to my Kirby and then our little thing that cleans the carpet from pet stains. And tucked way in the back, and you can see from the shadow that I'm on my phone, I have some TV trays that we barely ever use. So I'm just gonna take a quick step back so you can see it. It's not perfect, but God, it's better than what it was, and it's so functional. I cannot wait to have this next year, and I am so excited to get cleaning. If you guys made a video, make sure that you add it to our playlist. I can't wait to see what everybody else um, chose to do for their closets. Like I said, I'm going to link Heidi's channel down below so that you can see her video and um, tell her that I sent you. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See y'all next time. Bye now.